the first equation here is 480 upon x equals to 480 upon x minus 8 minus 3 and the second equation is y into 10y minus 1 equals to 2 now you just have to cross multiply right don't worry about anything else so if i cross multiply what happens see first first of all it is like this 480 by x equals to 480 minus 3 times of x minus 8 by x minus 8 if you want you can just cancel out 3 everywhere right 3 into 1 3 into 160 and 3 into 160 because anyway in quadratic equation you have to take the common part out and now you cross multiply so we get 160 x minus 8 160 times of x minus 8 equals to 160 x minus x into x minus 8 yeah so what happens 160 x minus 160 into you can cut down the steps here 160 x minus x squared plus 8 x so 160 x cancelled on both the sides so yeah the equation is simple right x squared minus 8 x minus 160 into 8 equals 0 solve that quadratic equation so instead of directly giving the quadratic equation x squared minus uh, 8x minus 116 to 8 he has made it a little tricky yeah so simplify it i think you can take 32 and 40 there and the right hand side equation i mean the equation in y is very simple right that's like 10y squared minus y minus 2 equals to 0 you know how to solve quadratic equations solve the two equations and get the roots yeah this is simple 10y squared minus 5y plus 4y minus 2 equals 0. So 5y into 2y minus 1 plus 2 into 2y minus 1. So y is either 1 by 2 or minus 2 by 5. Here like I said uh, this should be minus 40 plus 32. I think that will help us. x squared minus 40x plus 32x minus 116 to 8 because 116 to 8 and 14 to 30 is same this is 16 into 5 or this is 8 into 5 8 into 4 sorry and 4 into 40 is 116 balanced so x of x minus 40 plus 32 into x minus 40 so what are the values of x x will be equal to 40 or minus 32 40 or minus 32 so if you take x equals to 40 x is greater than y x is anyway greater than y if you take minus 32 x becomes less than y so i think x and y cannot be compared you cannot arrive at an answer because all the possibilities are there x equals to 40 means x is greater than y but when you take x equals to minus 32 x becomes less than y in this case you compare 40 with 1 by 2 so 40 is greater than 1 by 2 you compare minus 32 with 1 by 2 minus 32 is less than 1 by 2 so x and y cannot be compared